Hey Michael, I think this is gonna work. Um, I have been working on this for uh, for a week, about a week. Uh, I purchased uh, this two ESP32 modules uh, last week, probably on May the seventh, and uh, I did a bunch of uh, experiments. And I started from the very beginning, and I found out uh, the communication between this ESP to this uh, acceleration sensor, accelerometer, and they worked really well. And also, uh, this uh, data center works pretty well with the SD card um, adapter as well. And the very the very last step is what I just did, and I verified uh, what is uh, communication between these two modules. So the, the data is going to be received by this module. So this will be mounted under the hoof. And so the wireless data is going to be sent from this antenna and being received by this module's antenna. And then the data will be saved to the SD card in here. Uh, but they are all of them are off-the-shelf modules, but I, I'm pretty sure I can uh, make a small enough version and mount it under the hoof um, and collect the data in, in that way. And there was a question about the data speed. And you can see that I'm actually uh, collecting using a, um, you know, it's a commercial GUI from the software, but actually it's, it's, it couldn't actually take the data to somewhere else. Uh, but you can see that in real time when, if I take these two modules and if I, shake it just for example it's trying to uh, mimic the movement of the hoof and you can see that it's being resolved really well so actually you can see that if i do it quickly so you can see that the data are uh it's, it's responding really well it's not like um you know the, the, the data probably the bandwidth of the wireless communication is not enough so which means probably it's going to drop some of the data packages, but actually it's it's pretty well. I'm, maybe there will be some data points being dropped, but I can see the data is actually pretty smooth. You are not seeing like very, very bad steps. Okay? So if I shake, you'll see that. The signal has a pretty decent resolution, I think. And you can see that you you can imagine that it's it's just directly from here to here, and the the data is being sent to, from here to here wirelessly. And also, uh, I'm collecting the data using a PC. So which means actually this this can be way slower than the SD card. So if I save the data to the SD card, the resolution will be way higher than this. I mean, even this one is doing a real-time display, it's working. I'm pretty sure that if you save on the SD card, you can get a way better signal than this, you know? Um, I think, I'm pretty sure, I'm pretty confident I can, I can make it work. So um, hopefully this will help you for whatever you want to show it to some somebody else. All right, thank you for watching.